Hey folks, let's talk about my favorite topic, testing. Today we're gonna to focus on two types of testing, A-B testing and multivariate testing. So A-B testing is when you compare two versions of a web page or app to determine which one performs better. And when you run an A-B test, you compare the current experience against a variation. And this lets you ask focused questions about your proposed changes, collect data about the impact of that change, and then make business decisions based on that data that you collect. Now, multivariate testing is very similar, but it has higher dimensions than an A-B test. So say you have two features that you'd like to test variations of instead of just one. So if feature A has two possible states, on and off, and feature B also has two possible states, in a full factorial scheme, you have four different combinations. A on, B off, A off, B on, a on, B on, and A off, B off. So segmenting your user base into four parts in this way is gonna let you know which individual elements produced the change and further, how much each one contributed. So now the question is, how do you know which type of test to run? The biggest problem with multivariate testing is that you need a really high traffic platform to have enough users coming through in each group to get significant results in a reasonable amount of time. So because the number of groups grows exponentially with the number of tested variations, you should be careful to make sure that you have enough traffic to make a multivariate test worthwhile. So for a lower traffic platform, it's best to run an A-B test, and if you for sure have um, a very high traffic platform and you can run the test for a really long period of time, then you can run a multivariate test.